hello how to solve for s in this equation s to the power of 3 minus s square is equal to 18 solution we have s to the power of 3 minus s square is equal to this 18 can be written as 27 minus 9 then this is s to the power of 3 minus s square is equal to this can be written as 3 to the power of 3 minus 9 can be written as 3 square then this is s to the power of 3 minus s square if you bring this to this side, it becomes minus 3 to the power of 3. Then, if you bring this minus 3 square to this side, it becomes plus 3 square is equal to 0. Yeah. Then, we have s to the power of 3. This is minus 3 to the power of 3. Then, we have minus bracket here is a square minus three square is equal to zero because if you open this bracket you are going to get a square we are going to get minus a square plus three square now take note of this exponential rule that if you have a to the power of three minus b to the power of three this is equal to a minus b bracket a square plus a b minus b square then also if you have a square minus b square this is equal to a plus b bracket a minus b and from here, this will go for this, then this will also go for this. Where, where A is equal to S and then B is equal to 3. Now let's substitute into this equation we have s minus 3 bracket this is a square plus 3 multiplied by s plus 3 square minus then we have s plus 3 bracket x minus 3 is equal to zero then we have s minus 3 bracket bracket this is s square plus 3 multiplied by x that is 3 s plus 3 square that is 9 minus x is s plus 3 bracket s minus 3 is equal to 0 then if you look at this here and here s minus 3 is common let's bring it out we have s minus 3 bracket if you divide the all of this by this we have s square plus 3 s plus 9 minus if you divide this by this we have s plus 3 is equal to 0 now here we have s minus 3 bracket this is s square plus 3 s plus 9 
then if you multiply this minus by s we have minus s and this minus by plus 3 we have minus 3 is equal to 0 then this is s minus 3 bracket bracket this is s square 3s minus s we have plus 2 s 9 minus 3 plus 6 is equal to 0. There are two cases here. The first case is s minus 3 is equal to 0 and the second case is s square plus 2s plus 6 is equal to 0. Then from here s is equal to 3. Let's call this x1. This is the first value of x. And from here, this is a quadratic equation which can be solved using quadratic general formula. And a quadratic general formula is given as s is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2a then from this equation a is equal to 1 b equal to 2 c is equal to 6 let's substitute then from here s is equal to minus 2 plus or minus square root of 2 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by c is 6 divided by 2 multiplied by 1 s is equal to minus 2 plus or minus square root of 2 square that is 4 minus 4 times 1 Thanks, six. That is twenty-four divided by two. So s is equal to minus two plus or minus square root of four minus twenty-four. That is minus twenty divided by two. S is equal to minus 2 plus or minus minus 20 can be written as 4 multiplied by 5 multiplied by minus 1 divided by 2. But we know that square root of minus 1 is equal to i. Then this is S is equal to minus 2 plus or minus square root of 4 that is 2 root 5i divided by 2. Now s is equal to minus 2 divided by 2 plus or minus 2 divided by 2 root 5i. This will cancel this. This will cancel this. s is equal to minus 1 plus or minus square root of 5i. Therefore, s2 is equal to minus 1 plus root 5i and then s3 is equal to minus 1 minus root 5i and our final answers are s1 is equal to 3 then s2 is equal to minus 1 plus root 5i then s3 is 
minus 1 minus root 5i. You can see that here we have one real root, then two complex root. This is complex root. And this is another complex root. The only root we have, the only real root we have here is three. We can check to confirm if answer is right or wrong. Let's check. To check, we have the given equation s to the power of three minus s square is equal to eighteen. Then when s is three, which is the only real root, here we have to the power of 3 minus 3 square must be equal to 18. Then here, 3 to the power of 3, this is 27, minus 3 square, this is 9, must be equal to 18. Then 27 minus 9, this is 18, is equal to 18, which is true. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.